Welcome back to Teshki Defects for another Gala Games price prediction update. And in this video, I'll be giving you the latest developments that have been happening here on the Gala Games chat. And before I kickstart the video, make sure that you give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and also check out the channel membership. And in this video, I'll also be giving you the fundamental analysis here on the Gala Games chat, where you can first get to the fundamental analysis, where you can see that yesterday, Gala released that they are making a partner with the rock and also mark where they'll be developing two films with the two hollywood stars the platform further said that gala film will use gala as its own gas token and that's the reason as to why we had a very huge pump yesterday as a result of the fundamental analysis and getting back to the chart for further analysis and also give you the technical analysis that i'm expecting to play out here on the gala games chart by first giving you a recap of what has been happening you can see that gala games from this the prices that we had been trading within we saw a very nice bounce to the upside making it to an all time high at around the 0.85 dollar mark in what i'm terming as a higher edu 12 count one to the upside and after seeing the all time high we started the bear market where we have been seeing no prices in this abc corrective structure which has now taken us back to around the 0.015 dollar mark in what i'm terming as a higher edu 12 count two to the lower side and after seeing the formation of a second wave whatever we expect next is a bounce to the upside in the formation of a higher edu 12 con 3 and sketching out a minimum target area by connecting the trend based fibonacci from the low of the first wave to the high of that wave one then dragging the fibs to the low of the second wave that gives me a minimum target area at the fib level 1.618 which perfectly lies at around the 1.36 dollar mark and that is the minimum that i would expect that wave three to the upside to do and that is what i'm expecting to play out on the long-term scenarios and getting to the short-term scenarios that i'm expecting to play out here on the gala games chart i can start my analysis here on the daily chart where we have been seeing a chart pattern which has continued to be obeyed which is a falling wedge which i expected to give us a breakout to the upper side and the moment we managed to break above the 20 day ma we had the support for us to continue pushing even higher so a breakout out of the chart pattern to the upper side and after the breakout was in here on the daily chart we saw a retest of that upper trend line of that falling wedge then we have continued pushing even higher and from these candlesticks that have information here on the daily chart you can see we have been seeing very long weeks here on the daily chart meaning there are chances that whatever we are seeing as a result of these long weeks that we are seeing right here that is a sign that the buyers could be losing the momentum for them to continue pushing even higher here on the gala games chart and that is better seen on the one hour chart as a result of the short term scenarios that i have here on the one hour chart and here on the one hour chart you can see that after making our low at around the 0.015 dollar mark we started a very nice bounce to the upside in a move that has been obeying the edu 12 structures and if i give you a measure from the low that we made at around the 0.015 dollar mark to the high that we have made right here on the charts you can see that gala games is up by more than to 34.58 percent that is from its lower low and that is a very nice bounce to the upside and if i zoom in so that you can also see the edu 12 structure that i have right here you can see i have this edu 12 structure in blue having that as the first wave then a wave two a wave three then a wave four and then a wave five completing the formation of that higher edu 12 count one to the upside and that is after making a high at around the 0.05108 dollar mark and that is yesterday and i believe we might have seen the high for this higher edu 12 count one to the upside and whatever we expect next after seeing the formation of a higher edu 12 count one is the formation of a higher edu 12 count two which is a corrective wave and sketching out a minimum target area to the lower side in the formation of this wave two by connecting the fibonacci's from the low of the first wave to the high of that wave one that gives me a minimum retracement area between the fib level 0.5 and the fib level 0.618 which perfectly lies between the 0.3344 dollar mark and the 0.29 to four dollar mark and that is the minimum that i'm expecting that second wave uh, to do here on the gala games chart and because the second wave is a corrective wave i'm also expecting to see an abc corrective structure so i'm expecting to see such a move having the wave c 
fully maximizing the formation of this second wave to the lower side and once we see that abc corrective structure then we can name that as a higher edit wave count true to the lower side and also taking a look at the indicators to see what movements will be supported on the rsi on the rsi we are trading at around the 56 mark meaning we have massive room for us to support any movements to the lower side in the formation of this second wave which is my primary scenario and also taking a look at the macd here on the macd we have been able to print a bear cross meaning lower prices are still coming our way but you can also see that we are losing the uh, the selling momentum and that means there are chances of printing a bullish cross once more and maybe see a reversal here on the charts and continue pushing even higher and maybe make one more lower high in the formation of that higher edu 12 count one to the upside before we see that abc corrective structure in the formation of this second wave so let's be patient and see how that plays out and i'll keep you updated